Shown from three different cameras, this is the 4 a.m. chase to find the driver later identified as Kyle Wagner. He's accused of driving away on January 14th in someone else's car. In the back seat was a woman who woke up to the high speed ride. This is her call for help. Oh, I was in a gas station. My husband just got out from the car. The victim told dispatch she doesn't know where she is. He can hear her talking with Wagner. Okay, no, no, I'm not telling you anything because I'm really scared. You know, you should get back. Please, no. No, you are not. No, you are not turning around. According to a criminal complaint, the victim said Wagner told her he was a truck driver and there was a conspiracy people wanted to kill them, so he was saving her. Why you take the car from the, from, from the gas station? Who's following us? My husband, of course it's my car. The deputy behind the squad car footage is cited in court documents. He details how Wagner drove at about 90 miles an hour and on the wrong side of traffic. That is until a state patrol car used a chase tactic to cause the car to crash into a guardrail. Watch as the car lifted into the air and airbags exploded. The victim came out first from the back seat, crying. No, I was scared. Read. I don't know I who's this were. guy. Who's this guy? <laughs> Officers then took the 51-year-old man from New York into custody. After admitting he used fentanyl and meth within 24 hours, Wagner now faces multiple felony charges.